Merhabalar, ben Sercan. Welcome back to your Turkish journey. Today, we're still going on with nominals, but this time we're going to see the conditional form of the nominals. And to do that, we will use the conditional mood of the copulative verb. Please always remember, we are talking about the nominals. We are focusing on the nominal. That is to say, noun, adjective, or an adverb, for example. Not a conjugated verb. Until now, I have always mentioned that when the copulative verb is attached to a nominal, the nominal becomes the predicate of the sentence. For example, Sercan öğretmendi. Sercan öğretmendi. Or, Ayşe zenginmiş. Ayşe zenginmiş. However, when the conditional mood of the copulative verb is attached to a nominal, the nominal does not become the predicate. What this mood does is to add a condition to the predicate since there is already a predicate in the sentence. Here is an example. O, akşamları çok yorgunsa erken uyur. O, akşamları çok yorgunsa erken uyur. The copula in this example is sa. Sa. As you see, it is attached to a nominal. Yorgun. Yorgun. Which means tired. But it does not make the nominal the predicate of the sentence. In this sentence, the predicate is uyur. Uyur. It is a conjugated verb. Another example. Çorba lezzetliyse... Ben de içmek isterim. Çorba lezzetliyse ben de içmek isterim. Here again, the copula is attached to lezzetli, which means tasty, delicious. And then there's a buffer letter, ye, in between. Now, you might be asking why there's a buffer letter in between. But hold on, you will understand it in a second. Another example. Şu sercansa bir merhaba diyeyim. Şu sercansa bir merhaba diyeyim. As you see, the copula is attached to the nominal. Please remember once again, we focus on the nominals. Now, let's take a look at some technical details and then see more examples. The copulative verb of the conditional mood is ise, ise. As we already know from the previous lessons, e is the verb stem of the copulative verb and se is the tense suffix for the conditional mood. İse, ise, bugün yorgun ise yarın görüşürüz. Bugün yorgun ise yarın görüşürüz. As you see, the copulative verb for the conditional mood follows the nominal. Yorgun ise. Yorgun ise, şu oda temiz ise toplantıyı orada yapalım. Şu oda temiz ise toplantıyı orada yapalım. If you remember from the previous videos, nowadays we always attach the copulative verb to the nominal, like this. Şu oda temizse toplantıyı orada yapalım. Şu oda temizse toplantıyı orada yapalım. The copula is attached to the nominal like a suffix and the verb stem of the copulative verb e always drops şu oda temizse şu oda temizse and as usual for all suffixes the vowel in the suffix modifies depending on the vowel harmony so it could be either se or sa safiye mutluysa Ben de mutluyum. Safiye mutluysa ben de mutluyum. In this one, mutlu receives the sa suffix. And since mutlu ends in a vowel, there is a buffer letter ye in between. Safiye mutluysa. Safiye mutluysa. In addition, if you are talking about the personal pronouns other than the third singular, as usual, the person suffix will be attached to the copula. That means the nominal, and then the copula, and then 
the person suffix. Now, let's take a look at this for all personal pronouns. Ben üzgünsem, sen üzgünsen, o üzgünse, biz üzgünsek, siz üzgünseniz, onlar üzgünseler, or onlar üzgünse. And you may even hear this for the third plural. Onlar üzgünlerse, onlar üzgünlerse, where the copula is attached to the person suffix unusually. Now, let's see additional examples. Sorular kolaysa, herkes geçer. Sorular kolaysa, herkes geçer. Bu hastalık bulaşıcıysa, mutlaka maske takmamız lazım. Bu hastalık bulaşıcıysa, mutlaka maske takmamız lazım. Evdeyseniz sizi ziyaret etmek istiyoruz. Evdeyseniz sizi ziyaret etmek istiyoruz. As you see, in this example, ev is the nominal. Ev, it is a noun. And locative case suffix is attached to it. Evde, evde. The copula is actually attached to the case suffix with a buffer letter in between. So, when we use the conditional mood copula with a noun like this, the noun can also be with a case suffix. Evdeyseniz, evdeyseniz. Bu mektup size ise buyurun alın lütfen. Bu mektup size ise buyurun alın lütfen. Here, the conditional mood copula is attached to another nominal. It is a pronoun, a personal pronoun with a dated case suffix, which makes it an object pronoun. Bugün hava soğuksa evde vakit geçirelim. Bugün hava soğuksa evde vakit geçirelim. Before we finish this video, I would like to mention that in Turkish there is another ise and it is a conjunction. I will cover that topic in another video and I will show you how you can make a distinction between these two. All right, this is the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you have any questions, please let me know. See you in the next videos. Görüşmek üzere.